Welcome to this course. In this lecture, we will start with the basics and examine the barriers, the practical barriers for creativity and how Scamper can be a powerful tool to drive creativity. Before we get to define Scamper and understand more, let's take a few minutes to recap our understanding about creativity. So what is the official definition of creativity? The ability to transcend ideas, rules, patterns, relationships and other things and to create meaningful ideas, forms, methods, interpretations, etc. is officially defined as creativity. Now forget the official definition. All of us know what creativity is. Creativity is usually considered as originality. It's considered as ingenuity, progressiveness, or sometimes even imagination in modern industry. Now, if we talk about few facts that we all understand about creativity, most of us associate creativity with artistic work like painting, arts and crafts, and feel that there's not much of scope of creativity in our jobs. That may or may not be true. The good news about creativity is that most of us are naturally creative and all of us can learn to be creative. That's the good news. Now we are going to talk about the bad news. Most often we are unable to go beyond the conventional thinking. So there is an inherent barrier. Why? Because most of us fear of failure and are not willing to risk and think unconventional. Now further, some of us lack the ability to articulate our creativity, though we may be naturally creative. So there is a challenge with our articulation. Even if you are not one of them, you will agree that at some point or the other, you have felt a lack of creativity. Many times, even if we consciously make efforts to be creative, we are not able to do so. The challenge is not with our creativity, but it is the inability to stimulate our natural creativity. So it's all about stimulation and it has nothing to do with our creativity. So that is the message that I'm trying to give. If you are one such person, all you have to do is to find a smart way to stimulate your creativity. And the best way to do that is using Scamper. With Scamper, you can become instantly creative. Edward de Bono, the father of lateral thinking states that creativity involves breaking out of the established patterns in order to look at things in a different way, very similar to the definition of creativity that we talked about. The principles of Scamper help you to break your established patterns. It plants the seeds or acts as a stimulus for you to think differently. As an example, I want to state two scenarios that I have not personally experienced but I have heard about it and I am sure they must be true. One is about an airline which wanted to reduce their cost because they were under tremendous cost pressure and uh, people were thinking on what they could do and they came up with all great ideas but an employee said that in the meal that we serve in the flight if we reduce the number of olives by one then if you sum up all the olives that we save, that amounts to a huge cost save. So this sounds like crazy, but I'm sure it's about eliminating something or reducing something, thereby making sure that you're able to achieve your goal. So it's a very, very simple and easy way of achieving the target rather than trying to do something completely very different or great. The next example is a little bit controversial, but I still want to share that. It's about a toothpaste company which wanted to increase its revenue. So what they did was to increase the, the diameter of the orifice through which the paste comes out of the tube. So you always squeeze it at the same level of force and it dispenses more paste and so the consumption increased it seems. Again this is a story that I've heard and I have not done it or not experienced it. But in this context of Scamper, it 
greatly simplifies the problem and gives us a solution that is very very unconventional usually when you want to increase revenue people talk about new products they talk about marketing strategy they talk about positioning etc but here is a very simple and silly idea that could help them get i guess 20 or 30 percent more revenue so i only want to state that scamper can give you great results the ability to both think and think differently is indeed your natural trait all you have to do is to have systematic training so with that note i'm going to wrap up this lecture as we move forward we will talk about the scope and application of scamper thank you